Greetings and welcome back to Idle Miner Tycoon. Okay, so we're in the Heliodor mine. I think that's the way you say it. Uh, I made a slight adjustment down here. What I did was I kicked this bottom one here up to 25 and it was making a lot more money. So you can see it's actually doing a lot better now. Uh, but of course, we're not going to be here. Oh, by the way, you might notice there's like a little shining star over here. The reason for this is because we can now do the prestige of the diamond mine. We have enough money to do that. But we're not going to be doing that. Why are we not going to be doing that? Well, that's because it appears we didn't have to wait until the weekend. We have a Hollywood mine, which is going for, at the time of recording, five days and five hours. I hope that started this morning. So, we're doing an event mine. So, let's take a look at the event and let's hope that the rewards were anything as good as the last one. All right, let's go on in. All right, participation award. Open up Mine Chef 1. All right, that's a standard right there. Okay, Mine Chef 5, 10 super cash. Well, that's fine. Okay, we got a two times for an hour for Mine Chef 10. That's pretty good. Okay, Mine Chef 15. This is where we get the bronze Hollywood badge, right? And that is going to be a two times for four hours. That's pretty good. And I see there's a green skill point sitting right there. All right, so Mineshaft 20, we get one green skill point. We get 15 super cash. That's pretty darn good. I'm, I'm good with that. The green skill points are very, very important. They let you actually manipulate the return from the actual mines themselves, which is very good. All right, so let's look at Mineshaft 25. Mineshaft 25, we'll get a two times for an hour. Okay, that's fine. And 20 super cash. Pretty easily to do. Pretty easy to do. All right, now, if we get to mine shaft 30, we get a green skill point, a common chest, and 45 super cash. All right, that's fine. Basically, getting down to 30 doesn't really require a lot of effort, right? You just build them up and then you wait until the barrier goes down and you build them up. You know, these are the event mines. These aren't the real mines, right? So, all right, now let's get to the real meat here, right? This is, of course, the leveling of individual mines. Now, Mine Chef 16, if we get that to level 500, we get the Silver Hollywood Badge. And we also get a five times for an hour. That's not bad at all. And a green skill point and 60 super cash. Okay, so that's not bad. That's not bad at all. Now, if we get Mine Chef, whoop, if we get Mine Chef 20 to level 600, that one requires a little effort. See, the 16 to 500, you kind of have to max out the first couple of mines. Probably, if you max out the first three mines, you can do that. Level, mine shaft 20 to 600, you probably have to get down a bit further there. Maybe like 10, 11, probably 11. You have to max them out, you know, all the way to 800. But if you do that, you get a 10 times for an hour, a rare chest, and 80 super cash. Okay, 10 times for an hour is pretty good. Pretty good. I should start using some of them in these events. Make it easier on me. All right. Now, the next one is going to be, oops, Mineshaft 25 to 700. Now, that's a little bit on the trickier side. You kind of have to max them out down to about 21, 22 for that. Because not only is it low, you have to get it up to 700. So that one, that's not too easy. So let's just see. If you do that, if you get Mineshaft 25 to level 700, you get... Two times for 12 hours, two rare chests, a, okay, a green skill point, and 100 super cash. It's not bad. Not bad at all. Now, the big one, of course, and that is bring everything to max level. All of the mine shafts to 800, the elevator, and the warehouse to 2400. If we do that, we get the gold Hollywood badge. We get 10 times for four hours. That's a good one. All right, that's pretty good. A five times for an hour. We get two good ones there. A green skill point. And I see we're getting ice there too. Okay, five ice skill points. An epic chest and 200 super cash. That's pretty good. That's definitely worth doing. And with the amount of time, should be able to max that out. As long as they didn't add any extra difficulty to it. If it's like the last one, which was about the same length, shouldn't be a problem. All right, let's go on in and start it up. This is going to be, of course, the Hollywood badge. Okay, he's got his stars there. I guess he tore them up from the Hall of Fame there, you know? All right, so, okay, we got a movie going now here, right? Okay, I see thousands bonuses here. That's like, you know, a thousand bonus, 100 bonus. Those are like the stuff of, like, fantasy, right? Yeah, I know we have one. 
All right, so we got um, Hollywood cash. We got 10 of it. So we have to open up the first mine. So let's get going with this, right? And of course, right now we got the participation badge. He's just going to stand there forever unless we click on him. He's a slacker. The three of them are slackers. Until you got a manager breathing down their neck, they're just slackers. Okay, that amount of money is the same as we were getting in the last one. I'm just going to let him carry a little bit more over. Then I'm going to click on him again. Then I'm going to have the elevator go down and grab all that money. He can actually carry that amount of money. All right, and the miner, get him going again. Right, get back to work, you. All right, now we need that guy at the warehouse to carry all that money over there. It's, he's moving really slow, though. All right, here, you go back down there. And you go down and get that money. Okay, so we don't get the money until he puts that into the warehouse, which he did. He put that into the warehouse. So the well, first thing we need to do is we need to get Mineshaft 1 to level 5. And I don't think that's a problem. I'm just going to walk it there. Okay, so that's level 5. That means we can hire managers. And I'm sure these guys are really happy that we're going to have a manager breathing down their throat. All right, first dude here. Boom, right there in the Mineshaft. Okay, so I don't have to click on him anymore. All right, next one. We're going over here, and this is going to be in the elevator. All right, don't have to click on that one anymore. You, I'm just going to click on you anyway. And finally, over in the elevator, even though there is a super manager, I shouldn't say the elevator, it's the warehouse. Even though there is a super manager, I'm going to hire somebody. Okay, so the circle is now complete. So these guys now have managers. I don't have to click on them anymore. They're just going to do their work. Now, the next order of business, of course, is we only see one mineshaft. The reason is, is we have to get mineshaft number one to level 10. So let's just walk it there because that shouldn't be a problem at all. Okay, level 10. And you notice we got a little boost when we hit level 10 there. So, okay, so we need, okay, that's a little bit more expensive than the last one. It was, it's a, it was about 1300 the previous one, now it's going to be like nearly 1500 It's coming up on 1500 So it's a little more expensive, so I guess there's a little bit of added difficulty there. But you can see our little circle has gotten us that money. All right, so what we're going to do is we're going to put a manager over here. As soon as we have money carried over there, okay, so we need money. So where are you? Okay, he brought it over there. He brought it over. All right, so let's just uh, put a manager in there. And, of course, that's an upgrade cost manager. All right, that's good. Okay, so he's going to be dumping. Okay, that's not bad. So let's see. I'm sure the elevator can carry all of that now, right? All right, because we, now we have to save up 14600 And yeah, he's, he's, only, he's not carrying all of that. So we're going to have to upgrade the elevator and then the warehouse. The elevator is the important one, though. So let's, we got a little discount there. I'm just going to say max, and it's only going to be 4 but, you know, it does mean he's going to carry more up. So he's carrying 8,000 up now. All right, so he, he puts that up there, and the little warehouse dude is going to walk it over there. I do need to increase him, but what I'm going to do for the moment is I'm going to have him run really fast. That way he'll make more trips. Watch him run really fast there. All right, and I need to upgrade the elevator a little bit more. All right, let's just, let's just get that to 5. Yeah. Up five, I should say, to ten. That's a little boost there. The little boosts are really good for increasing. So he's carrying 23,000 up there. He, he got it all, so there's no problem. All right, so I am going to increase this one a little bit, too. Um, this Unfortunately, the boost for this one is like level 20, so I'm not doing that anytime soon. But with him running around and stuff like that, okay, so we should be able to do this one now. All right, so we got a lot of money up there. All right, we'll do this one now, and we'll put a manager in there. All right, that man, this guy, this mine here is going to generate a lot more money, probably more than the elevator can carry. Yeah, 38,000 right there. Of course, we need 146,000 for the next one. How much is he going to take now? Okay, he took 72. That is not bad at all. But uh, you know what? Oh, we lost our little discount here. All right, I'm still going to increase it just a little or maybe a lot. I'm just going to put nine in there. The reason is, is I don't want, see, it's 128 there. See, that's pretty much the amount of money that we need to open up the next shaft. We may need a little bit more, though. All right, so now this guy's going to be running around. Right, when he brings that one up, as soon as we have the amount of money, he goes over one more time, we're going to have that money. And as soon as I open that one below, I want to fix the, um, all right, we're going to do this. We're going to do this. 
All right, and boom, there we go. I need to work on the um, the warehouse now because he needs to carry more over at a time. We only have two minutes and 15 seconds left on this boost here. All right, so we need to get that to 20. Can I do 10? Yes, I can. Boom, all right, so we got a nice little boost there. So he's going to be able to carry anything this guy ca brings up now, right? So 469,000, and he just grabbed it all. No problem. All right, that's actually great because we're nearly at this amount of money now. All right, so hold a second. We got 676,000. We need 1.46 million. How much did you bring him? He's got a million sitting on top of there. So if he just brings that million over, we got it. And we got it. Okay. And, of course, this is going to be the executive. When I, when I summon this one, when I hire this one, this is going to be the executive. I'm not putting him there. I'm going to hire another one, and I'm going to put him in there. Because I want to use that executive. Okay, so now we need $23 million in order to get through that barrier. And you'll notice that this guy could not get past Mineshaft 4. So we're going to have to increase the elevator in order to get deeper in there. All right, so what do we got? I'm just going to do one to get to 20. And then let's see, what can we do? I think I can push it to 40 to the next boost. Right there. All right, so we got 40. So that's all he could carry right now. When he comes back up, he's got 23 million down there. See the 23 million? I can afford to spend everything right now on the elevator. Not the elevator, warehouse. I keep making that mistake. All right, so the reason for that is because all we need is the money he just brought up. Watch. As soon as they put that in, boom, we got that. Now, we could wait an hour and three minutes, but, ooh, 60. Did they raise that? I have, to pay, I have to spend 60 super cash. Okay, if you do it quick, there you go. Okay. That was painful. All right, now I need 146 million. All right, so how much are you bringing up? You're bringing up? All right, we need to start generating some more revenue here. This is where we start doing an overview of the, um, the entire mine. All right, let's look here. Okay, what just happened there? Something is going on. Let's just do that again. Okay, there's some kind of a weird thing going on here. So I'm going to do this. All right, so now the entire mine shafts down below in the middle are doing 711K per second. Now, if you'll notice that the warehouse and the elevator, they're, they're able to handle millions. So we need to get more production from the mine shafts. I have no idea what's going on there. Look at that. What is going on? Okay, so I don't know. Maybe there's some kind of an effect in the background that's interfering. Whatever it is, it's, it's kind of weird. All right, so what we need to do is we need to more production, right? We need more production. So I'm going to, this is what I'm going to do. This is what I'm going to do. I'm going to grab that, and I'm going to put that in there because I'm going to bring the little junior discount up here, and I'm going to try to make some money off of here. All right, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to try to get near 100. I'm going to try to get near 100. Now, if you look at the... Um, the mine shaft, the first mine shaft, they're, they got like 800. Watch them bring money over, right? 438. Let's see what we can do about that. Okay, boom. Okay, they just dumped 180 million there now. So obviously getting them over 100 definitely helped, right? Now the thing is, the elevator cannot handle that. If you look at them, they cannot handle that. Not even close. So we're going to have to start working on the, uh, the elevator and the warehouse because look we got billions there there's billions in the first spot right so obviously that's more money than we really need right now so we need to start doing some upgrading here right all right let's just say we kick that one up like to 60 right okay can he do that now no but he's doing a lot better now we have to fix the uh, or try to fix this over here right let me think can i just i can't do 50 let's just do 67 let's see is that going to handle a lot of it all right they just brought the 260 million over all right how much can you do now you still stuck there okay we need to increase that but you know i believe that we can do this now all right and we're going to hire a new manager actually we'll just throw that one in 
Okay, so how much is that one going to do? Let's just going to see he's carrying over, okay, 384 million are down there. But th this guy is hopelessly trapped up here right now. There's, there's three and a half billion sitting there. What do we need? Oh, we need like 1.46 billion, and we already have like double that sitting at the top. All right, so what we need to do is, um, yeah, we need more throughput over here. So let me think. What can we do? I can get that to a boost. 80. All right, that should do a lot better. How much of that 4 billion is he going to grab? Okay, he grabbed like, you know, 2.18 billion of it. So he's got a lot of that. Actually, that is what we need too. And I think that we can open this one now. All right, and we're going to throw a manager there. Okay, and what are they bringing over? Just going to check here. Okay, 3.84 billion. All right, he, he can go all the way down now. I don't think he can grab those. No, he can't. All right, so that's fine. Is there a, There's a big pile on top of the elevator, so we have to do something over here. Can we get that to 100? I think that would probably help, and I think it's worthwhile because there's a nice little boost there. All right, so he should be able to carry the most of that over now. I think there's three of them there. Yeah, it looks like there's three of them. And they just grabbed the 4.42 billion, right? Which means we could probably... We're closing in on that 14.6, right? Actually, like we're like 40% of that up above. But you know, the thing about it is we're going to have to spend some money on the elevator. Probably not the warehouse, but definitely the elevator. I'm figuring make that 100. Make that 100. See how much you're going to get now. It's like 38 billion sitting down there. Okay, that's 14.7 billion. That's not too bad. That will actually take care of it. Look, 14.6 billion. So if they bring that money up and they carry it over, we got the next uh, mine shaft to open up. So let's just take a look at it, make sure. They grabbed the whole thing. Between the three of them, they grabbed the whole thing. So as soon as they park that money in there, we're going to have this and we're going to have mine shaft 8 opened. There we go. All right, I'll hire another manager. Okay, so this one requires 146 billion. And notice he's stuck there. He can't get past seven. So we need to enhance them again. So we need to really invest now. So let's just see what we got. I think I could do 20 on each. And then we'll come over here. And then we're going to look at our overview, which I hope is, it's still, I don't know what's going on with that. I, I really don't. I have no idea what's going on with that. Okay, so the mine shafts are doing 7.16 billion, right? Okay, so it looks like the warehouse can handle it, but the elevator cannot. The elevator needs some help, because otherwise it's not going to carry. I don't know what's going on with that. All right, so let's do another one here. All right, let's see. And the elevator is now doing 13.16. All right, so the elevator can now handle what's coming from down below. All right, so what do we got here already? All right, we have, he's carrying up, carrying up 112 billion. And we need 146 billion. So I have a feeling we're about to get access to that. How much? Actually, we already do because they had a big load already. So boom, that's now open. Okay, this is mine shaft number nine, so we're going to hire somebody for that. Oh, we got the senior. That's okay. I'm, I actually, I don't like the senior to be there because I like to use the senior up above. Here, hold on a second. So we're going to grab that, and then what we're going to do is uh, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to put that one up above. Hold on a second. Let's go on over to the top. All right, because this one is not as good as this one. All right, so now what do we need for the bottom? Okay, we need 1.4 six trillion so we need to do some serious and there's a trillion sitting at the bottom there you see that how much are you taking now okay you need to be upgraded yes you do so we're going to do just that all right i'm thinking 10 on each of them because it's what i can do right now all right so let's see i don't know what's going on with this Okay, so the mine shafts are doing 71, the elevator is doing 33. Okay, first things first, we need to do something over here, right? And then we need to fix the elevator. I think I might wait the 12 seconds for that one to get a little bit better. Okay, there is 775 billion sitting at the top there. If they get that, we might have what we need. 
let's just see. What do we got? And they got, and we got it. Well, actually, really close there too. Boom. All right, so let's throw the exec there. Okay, so we got the first ten mine shafts open, and uh, we need forty-six trillion in order to start opening up this barrier. That's going to be my goal. After that, I'm just going to try to set them up to make as much money as possible, right? All right. Well, obviously, we're not going to be able to get deep into the trillions with what we currently have. But you'll notice that there's a lot of trillions sitting down there, but they're just not able to do it. So, at this point, I'm thinking I just go crazy and I give everything to the elevator, right? I know there's a boost there, but I'm just going to go boom like that. Because I want to make sure that that thing can grab everything. He grabbed the, the, the vast majority of it. He, he's like, like 28 billion? 28.1 trillion. I shouldn't say tr billion. I said trillion. All right, so before that comes over, let's see about increasing that one. Okay, they're bringing over trillions now. All right, I need 46 trillion. So how many trillions am I going to have now? Okay, they're not bringing it over very well. I got 34 trillion sitting at the top. They're just not bringing it over. So I do need to do an upgrade here. Just give them all 18. Okay, how much are you going to grab now? Okay, what is he? He's got 12. 12 is a much better number to get than two at a time, right? Okay, so they're bringing over a ton of money now. We're actually going to be pretty close to what we need. 41. All right, we need 46, so we're, we're nearly there. We're nearly there. As soon as we get that uh, going... Okay, I'm about to lose this one. Yeah, I know I shouldn't have done that. But I just saw the discount going away. I just spent all of our money now. Okay, but the money will come back. The money will come back. Right. Yeah, I mean, that was impulsive of me. I shouldn't have done that. It's going to take a little while to get back to the 46. We would have had the 46 if I had just had a little bit of patience there. But we'll get there. Now he's bringing everything up. Let's see. There's a 12 in there. Okay, 41. If they carry that over, we'll have it. Then I don't have to be patient. All right, let's go on down because we know this is going to start opening up. All right, there we go. All right, let's check out the mine at the moment. Okay, it, it seems to be doing okay now. Maybe it's just having that in the background up above. I don't know. I don't know what's going on with that. All right, so if the mine shaft is now producing... 711 billion per second. These guys are capable of catching trillions, right? So we need to boost the uh, production. Yeah, if I go up here and do that, yeah, something in the background about the graphic is causing that. All right, so I better make sure that if I'm going to do this, I do like that, and then it's fine. All right, I, I don't know what's going on back there, but they're doing something different. Okay, so what we're going to do is we need to start increasing the actual mines here now. So what I'm going to do is I got this senior here. So let's see what we can do about generating more money. All right, you know what that's going to be? That's going to be 200. Boom. Okay, so how much are you producing now? You're doing 351, 59. Okay, 92 trillion. Okay, that's going to help. But I don't think oh, he carried that. Okay, he's got that money. He's got all that money. Is the whole mine capable of handling that now? Let's see. Okay, you know what it is? The elevator can kind of handle it. The warehouse cannot. So we need to fix the warehouse quickly. Um, do we have enough money now to go looking for a good manager there? And not that this isn't a good manager. I just want the discount. I think I can get the exec at that price. So let's just see. There it is. Okay. Yeah, the exec is easy to get on the warehouse side. It's expensive to get on the elevator side. All right. So what we're going to do is boom, like that. All right. So we need to increase this. I'm going to say 20 because that oh, one more gets us a boost. Okay. One more gets us that boost. I don't think we have to worry about that one for a while. No, it's doing all right. Okay. So we need to increase the elevator a little bit. We do, actually, I can probably get the senior here. So let's see about that. All 
There it is. There's the senior upgrade cost reduction. All right, there I want. There it is. All right, yeah, the executive, if you were going to go looking for it, you would have to have money in the AB range, fairly deep into the AB range. Then you could do it, because otherwise you're just going to run out of money trying to hire. See, it's not random. They always occur in the same order, which is a little weird, but, you know, if that's the way you want to do it. All right, now I need to increase this one a little bit. I don't need to do that much, but if I add, like, 20 to it, that should be fine, right? Let's see. You handling all that? Yeah, actually, the elevator is really handling it, right? So I need to make some more money, right? Let's see. What do we have here? Do I want to do that? Hmm. There's two ways that I make money when I'm doing an event mine. The one that I usually do is I increase the first one. Because after all, in the end, you're going to have to max them out. So you might as well start with the first one because it's the easiest one to max out. Besides, once you max out the first one, you're making enough money that it's easier to max out the second one. So I kind of crawl down that area. You saw what that increase from 100 to 200 did, right? But the other way I like to do it, and the reason I have the exec sitting down here, is because you can also make money down here, too. All right, so let's just look at what we're doing. Currently, the mine shafts are doing 14.6 trillion per second, right? The first mine is 95.12% of the mine, which means the first mine shaft is doing virtually everything. Let's see about that. I can do 50. I can get mine shaft 10 to 50. Boom. All right, so I got mine shaft 10 to 50, and he's cranking in the trillions there. Oh, he's cranking in AA now, isn't he? All right, let's take a look at the mine now. Okay, so the mine shafts are now doing 2.57 AA per second. And remember that mine shaft that was doing 95%? It's now doing 0.54%. Why is that? Well, because the one we just raised up to 50 is doing 99 basically and a half, right? But of course, what that means is that the elevator and the warehouse cannot even dream of handling that flow of money, right? So there's a pile sitting down there, and we need to do something about it. All right, let's see. We're getting a lot of money. All right, I'm going to raise this one up. The reason for that is because we need that money coming up, right? So there's actually an AA sitting up there right now, and uh, he's bringing more up. He just brought 20 AA up, right? Now that all that money is flowing up, the L the pardon me, the warehouse needs to carry it over. So they're only carrying over a small portion. So let's see what we can do here. Just take all of it. Just take all of it, right? They were carrying over 136 trillion at a time. Let's see what they carry over now. Okay, they're carrying over 4.2 AA each, which is better. It's not perfect, but as soon as they drop that money off, right, I'm going to see about increasing it again. All right, so that one means they're probably going to grab all. Yeah, the first one just grabbed 50 AA, so he's fine. Let's take a look now at the, oh, 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 we need to move down. We need to move down. Okay, so let's see. Oh, well, the warehouse can easily handle the money. The elevator, not so much. So let's see what we can do over here before we lose this one. Should I just give it the 40? You know what? Here, take 40. So it's, 100, it's 281 now, right? And he just brought up 189 AA. So that's, that's pretty good. So let's see now. Okay, the mine shaft's doing basically 2.5 AA. The elevator can handle 55. The warehouse is nearly 20, which means we need to increase the mine shafts a bit. Now, I did lose the, um, the little buff over here, unfortunately. So maybe we can make some more money down here while we have a discount. I mean, if I was to add 35, would that increase something? Um, actually, yes. The mine shafts are now doing 174 AA, so the warehouse is in desperate trouble right now. Yes. So we have to do something about the warehouse, so let's just quickly do that. Yeah, I'm about to lose this discount over here. Um, so I'm just kind of spending it. Yeah, it's gone now. All right. Okay, so let's see how things are going now. They're doing better. They're doing better. The elevator and the warehouse are doing about 90 but of course, the uh, mine shaft is doing a little less than twice that. But that's still, that's not so bad. All right, so let's see. We're getting all that money pouring up, though, now, right? We, got, we have AB sitting on the top. 
So if they drop that money off, all right, now what I'm going to do is I'm going to put one of the uh, juniors in here. Some kind of discount is better than no discount. Okay. Um, let's drop 20 on each. And then here. Oh, oh, di oh, oh, boost. I got a boost. I didn't realize that. All right. Oh, I got to move it down otherwise. That's weird. I don't know what they did there. Okay, so they got it handled. They got it handled now, right? The mine shafts are still doing one, uh, 174 AA per second, and these guys are just able to handle that. So why don't we increase it? All right, I think there's a uh, little discount down here, so why don't we just say, uh, yeah, add 81 to it or something like that, right? All right, so that one is now back up to 67% of the mine, 67.5% of the mine. Uh, it's still being, oh, I shouldn't say that the warehouse isn't handling it. A little bit of help. Just a little bit of help, and then it should be fine. A little bit of help. And down here, just so we can see it. All right, they're both handling A, B, and, okay, we can probably increase that a little bit more when they drop some of that money off. All right, we're going to let them carry that money over. We're going to increase Mineshaft 1, maybe get it to 300. Or maybe not. Okay, I could just do five. That's all. Oh, 300 isn't a boost. Okay, 400 is the boost. All right, that's fine. A little bit more. Drop that off. And then we'll come down here, and then we'll just increase that a little bit more. All right. What do we got now? Okay, it's doing nearly an AB now. And the elevator and the warehouse can handle it. All right, so that's kind of the way you play it. You increase one... You increase the mine shafts, how much money they're making, and then you got to make it so the elevator and the warehouse can handle it. Once they can handle it, well, you can go down and you try to make more money, right? And like I said, you increase the first one. That's really the main goal. You want to increase that one, get that one maxed out, and then start working your way down the mine. Increasing the first one is a great way to fund doing the whole mine, just opening it up. So what I usually do is I'll have ones all the way down, but every once in a while... I'll step over here and mess with one of these. Be, okay, I, you know, why don't we just get it to 100? Because it'll be a nice little boost. I won't raise that one anymore. Because after all, when I open the next fifth, you know, five mines here, the one at the bottom there will actually be the biggest money gainer per level. See, this one is the best money per level. But this is the least expensive to raise. So you can make a lot of money by raising it up. So those are the two ways of handling it. But in the end, you got to max them all out. So you might as well start with the first one. And that's what I do. And I think that I just kind of unbalanced it again. Right, right. Okay, so the elevator. Let's see what we can do with the elevator. And it, I know there's no, no uh, discount there, but I'll just do that. And then I'll just come over here and I'll just throw some in there too. I think that should probably be closer to what we need. Yeah, they got that. They got that. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to let it go. I'm going to let it build up money, right? And when this barrier is ready, I should be able to buy the next five and maybe even fund the next barrier. So that's the way I'm going to do it. I'm going to charge to the bottom that way, right? Get to the bottom because that is what this says here. That's what your mission is, right? You go all the way down to Mineshaft 30. doesn't say anything about leveling them up or anything like that. You want to get to Mineshaft 30. After that, once you've opened up Mindjet 30, that's when it wants you to start leveling these guys up. So anyway, we got more than five days for this mine, and uh, it was enough time the last time, wasn't it? So we'll see what happens. It did seem to be slightly more expensive. We'll see what it looks like in the end. Anyway, this is, of course, the Hollywood mine that uses Hollywood cash. So next episode, we're going to do a prestige of the diamond mine. I think it was a diamond mine because we have more than enough money to work on that. And we may even have some money left over to uh, open up the ruby mine a little bit more. Maybe we'll use the super managers over there. So anyway, I think that's going to be it for now. So thank you very much for your attention. I really appreciate it. And play games because games are fun. See you.